Man, I'm hungry. Oh, oh wait, it's review time. Let's go, JTB review. All right, guys. This is going to be um, the last one here for the Deftones. We are going to be talking about Gore. Um, the last record by far here to date here in 2017 by the Deftones. And we have a lot to talk about here. We, um, you know, this is going to be the last one. And, um, you know, so let's go ahead and talk about this one. It was released April 8th, 2016. Um, it's a little, um, little uh, over uh, 45 minutes in length, coming up 48 minutes in length. Um, you know, producer, uh, Matt Hyde. Um, but let's go ahead and, um, let's get going on here. Um, I'm not going to go over the, uh, lineup. It's still the same, um, as previously. Um, let me talk about this one, though. Instrumentally wise, this record is amazing. It's awesome. It's really, really good. Uh, vocally, once again, I don't think Chino has just... Uh, he must be drinking like hot tea every day or something. Those vocal cords are, are still there from the first record up to now. Still good. Um, lots of melodic guitars as well. Um, even uh, Jerry Contrell from Allison Chains takes a little bite here um, at a feature um, here in the Phantom Bride. Kills it. Um, kills it. Um, it's very dreamy. Um, it's uh, trippy. It's a little bit slower than their previous records, and I'm digging it. Um, songs, each one of these songs have a great buildup, too. Every song at the end of it is just boom, 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 build up. Awesome peak. I love it. I love it. Um, it's also another great blend of heavy guitars and softer tone guitars. They just they they've always been a great mixture of that of, of being really heavy going into melodic sounding and then heavy again. They're always really good at that. Um, once again, very uh, experimental here. Um, lots of different genres. Um, another thing I also want to note here is um, you know a, a, as we end the Deftones um, discography, I, I gotta I gotta do um, you know kind of a moment of silence. Um, for uh, Chi, and uh, we're gonna do that here at the last part of it. But um, I want to go ahead and um, tell you guys that I really enjoyed this record. Songs kind of like Prayer and Triangles to start it out with. Phantom Bride with Jerry Control. How are you not gonna like that? Hearts and Wires was really good. Um, really, Doomed User was actually really nice too. Um, honestly, each one of these songs is really really good. Um, a lot of uniqueness as well. Um, you're definitely going to want to check this out. Um, it's definitely in the top 20 of records in 2016 that I really enjoyed. Um, I do remember giving this a listen when it came out once. Um, but now that I've listened to it about six times now, this is definitely a great solid record. Honestly, the Deftones never really have disappointed me like completely. Uh, they put out one bad record in a, what, 20 year career? which is amazing to me, and um, I give them all the credit. Um, if I really had to rate this one, guys, I'm going to have to give it a rating at an 8.5. I was really digging this one. It's a good, solid record. It's a little bit better than an 8. It's a B plus. Um, you know, great build-ups, great work on here. Honestly, it's it's just a good, solid record, and I, I really dig it. Guys, we're going we're gonna to leave it here. Um, I'm going to give uh, 10, 20 seconds here for uh, Chi Chang. Um, so, uh, go ahead and, uh, stay in silence with me, um, cause, uh, you know, it's sad seeing someone that the band loves, uh, go away, and, um, thank you, they, uh, they had the, thankfully, they had the faith and the strength to keep going on, so, in memory of, uh, Chi Chang, um, here's a moment of silence. Alright guys, that's it. Um, so I want to thank you guys for watching my reviews here through the Deftones. It's honestly been a great journey. Um, it's been really, really good. I want to thank you guys for recommending these um, these bands for me. Um, the Deftones was definitely a great band. I'm really glad I got to review them and get to know them a little bit better than I have. 
Um, I wish I was a, a fan before, but it was, you know, it's just one of those bands that they're just really hard to get into. And um, this is definitely one of those bands, but um, I'm starting to uh, get into them a little bit more. Um, I'm a little bit comfortable. I have uh, some adequate knowledge about them. And um, I'm just really happy they decided to keep going, honestly. I'm just so happy. And um, we're going to go at it with that, guys. And that is, um, this is the video that finished out my very first notepad of notes. And um, this is interesting, guys. That means my channel is going to, uh, it's getting big. It's getting, uh, <laughs> it's going to be getting another notebook here soon. Um, all right, guys. Well, we're going to end the Deftones off with that. And uh, my next band I'm going to be doing, it's going to take me a little while. Actually, it might not even take me a while, actually. Um, for me to get my notes, there's going to be a lot of discussions here with my next band. And it's going to be... Um, it's going to be Metallica coming up here soon. So I might have to do a few new bands once again because for some reason the new tracks get a lot more views and that's how you guys end up finding me, um, which is good. But I'm always going to do any band you guys want me to do. The next one is Metallica. So give me some time to be doing that one and I will get back with you guys. But for now, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. And it's been a, an amazing journey um, so far here in 2017. Um, guys, uh, the end of the year is coming. So, um, you know, just want to throw that out there. Album of the year is going to be really tough. So thank you so much, guys. And I will see you later. Have a good one.